Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we discuss a formula about ratio of speeds for train problems. You know, previous classes we discussed some formula and we have done some examples. We are going to use those concepts. Please watch those classes and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, we are going to discuss only one formula. Don't remember that formula. How we got that formula? We will explain you the procedure and we will show you a graphical intuition. So if you have that graphical intuition and procedure, you can solve any bit. The bits, if you, if you want to solve the bits, the procedure is very, very important. Remembering the formula will not help you in solving the bits. So understand it, understand it properly. If two trains or bodies start at the same time from points A and B towards each other and after crossing, they take A and B seconds in reaching B and A respectively. Then a speed is to B speed is given as square root of B is to square root of A. This is what the formula says. Now try to understand how we derive this formula step by step. First understand the question. One train started from A, another train started from, from B at the same time. They did not give you the distance. What's this distance from A to B? What's the distance? They did not mention. What's the speeds of the train? They did not mention. But uh, the two trains are moving each other means they are moving in the opposite direction towards each other means during the travel they met somewhere in the middle it you know it, it is not compulsory to, to meet here it may meet here it may meet here it's based on the speeds of the trains assume that they met here after meeting B train from here to here it takes B seconds after meeting train A from here to here it is traveling in A seconds it takes B train take B seconds A train take A, A seconds to travel from here to here B train take B seconds to travel from here to here that is what they have given A seconds and B seconds so the ratio of their speeds is given as square root of B is to square root of A how we got that Let's try to understand that. Uh, one important point you have to understand from this question. We are assuming the speed of the train A is U seconds. Speed of the train B is V seconds. Uh, now the important point you have to understand. Whenever they are moving each other, moving towards each other, they meet somewhere in the middle at some position. So the point you have to understand here, by whenever they met, a travel t seconds b travel t seconds they travel same number of seconds by the time they meet that is the point this is the logic this is this is what we will use to derive this yes up to now it traveled b travel t seconds a travel t seconds and one more important point in our last classes we discussed that both are moving each towards each other and they met here means they covered this entire distance that is what relative speed is uh, this is the this is what we have discussed in our previous classes formulas means they meet up to here means these two trains covered this entire distance they are moving each other means we have to apply relative speed so with this intuition, we are going to derive this. So distance is equal to speed into time. We are assuming this entire distance as x. x is equal to from here to here, here to here. They covered the entire distance. So x distance covered is equal to t seconds. What's the relative speed? u plus v. So observe. You, you will get good clarity about previous formulas also. How we are going to use that formula. So x is equal to the same way. x is equal to the train started at A. Travelled up to here for t seconds. After that it travelled A seconds to cover the entire distance. So x is equal to t plus A. Speed is u. Same way the, tra the train travelled from here B. B. 
traveled up to here for t seconds after that it traveled b seconds to cover the entire distance so x is equal to t plus b multiplied by v s multiplied by t so we got three equations equate 1 and 2 whenever you equate 1 and 2 ut plus vt is equal to ut plus ua ut ut cancel vt is equal to ua equate 1 and 3 you get ut plus vt is equal to vt plus vb ut is equal to vb from this equation we are taking t is equal to vb by u now take the this equation vt is equal to ua substitute t v in place of t we are placing vb by u that is equal to ua v square b is equal to u square a v square by u square by v square is equal to b by a u by v is equal to square root of b square root of a we got the equations u v means speed of the train a speed of the train b speeds of train a and b is to b is given as square root of b is to square root of a this is how we derived so you have to remember this the main thing is what is this this is what it is very important to remember that helps you a lot in solving the questions which we discuss in our next classes hope you understand the equation if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you